All right, so today I have two different sauces. I have Rouse, this is my favorite sauce that I use on my pasta as well as other things. And right here I have vodka sauce and I also have Avarada, Arabiata sauce. I can never say that correctly, uh, but that's the sauces that I have. I'm gonna try this vodka sauce on to my pasta right here and let you know how it tastes. I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. If you ever tried Rouse, it's probably the best jarred pasta sauce available. If not, it comes close. So here it is inside. It's a little thick. If you heat it up, it actually gets a little bit thinner. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and pour some of the sauce on to my pasta. I'm getting up close so you can see it. So I'm gonna pour it on here like this. I'm gonna try it out to let you know how it tastes. Now it always tastes better when you heat it up, but I like actually like putting it straight from the jar at room temperature onto my pasta. So I'm gonna go ahead and stir this up a little bit and get a little bit on my fork and tell you how this is. All right, so go ahead and try this. It sticks to the pasta fairly well. I used uh, Di Secco pasta. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and try this. Really good. Pasta sauce, if you like the vodka sauce, I mean, this is probably the best vodka sauce that you would taste outside of going to an Italian fine dining restaurant or something that your grandmama will make. I like how it sits on there. It's not too pasty. As you can see, some of the seeds from the pasta are sitting, or from the pasta sauce are sitting on the pasta. And it, it, there's clumps of tomato, tomato on there as well. Let's, let me take one more bite. This is so good. I would actually add a little bit of Parmesan cheese on it, but I'm out of it. Uh, but this is good right here. This is the vodka sauce. And you should also try out the Arabata. Biata sauce. It's pretty good itself. Hope this was helpful.